Hi, you're watching Real Loop. I'm Gina Morelli. In this episode, we'll discuss inventory beginning to inch up in a housing market parched for more supply. Buyer demand has decreased, marking the first sequential decline since November. We see that reflected in the Home Purchase Sentiment Index, where 35% of respondents in May 2021 said it's a good time to buy compared to 61% in June 2020. Similarly, the Monthly Showing Time Index displayed a decrease in May compared to March and April. This could be caused by buyer fatigue, likely as a result of high price appreciation, low inventory, high percentage of sales over list price, and low days on market. As we've said before, we are experiencing an extreme seller's market, which will likely continue into the near future. However, in the latest month's Inventory of Homes for Sale report from NAR, we can see the frenzy starting to ease with a slight increase in inventory. Another indicator of likely inventory increase is the skyrocketed home equity with an average gain of $33,400 for just under a 20% increase. The average equity of mortgaged homes is currently $216,000 and 38.2% of homes are owned free and clear. Tapping into the significant equity will be a likely motivator for potential sellers. Looking at these quotes from experts at First America, Haas, and NAR gives us even greater cause to expect more inventory to enter the market, which we also see evidence of in this NAR inventory report of single-family homes. The month-over-month -month change in housing inventory reported by Realtor.com shows an average increase of 8.8% across the country, with Oregon coming in at 18.1%. Mortgage rates are projected to rise with an average forecast of 3.57% by the end of the fourth quarter. Home price forecasts have increased to an average of 8.9% from about 5% at the beginning of the year since the amount of inventory entering the market did not meet expectations. If you'd like to know more, send us questions or post comments. We are always looking for better ways to serve our community and hearing from you helps us do that. Stay safe and don't forget to follow us for more videos and updates.